Hello guys and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. In the last episode, if you don't remember, we went ahead and hung out with Yuko a bit, who totally doesn't have a crush on us, and we also got to talk with Maiko a bit, who is the young girl of the shrine, and we're sort of just kind of getting through, and we're sort of just kind of progressing through social links. Uh, we're doing fairly good. Most of these are still in the early stages, except for Maya, who we had Golden Week, which means we were able to quickly level up her a bit. And then most of these are either twos or threes. Uh, in this episode, like I mentioned previously, we're actually going to be getting a new social link soon, so get excited for that. Hey. Man, I wish there was an easier way to get to Tartarus. I ain't even talking about climbing, because first we gotta go all the way to school, right? But uh, what if I just opened my door and at least straight to Tartarus? Now that would be nifty. Stop spewing nonsense already. Why on earth would anyone want their door to be connected to Tartarus? Hmm. I know apathy syndrome isn't exactly natural, but even then, something seems off about it. Maybe I'm just being pessimistic, but I find I'm usually right about the bad stuff. Did you have a productive golden week? As for myself, I generally stuck to the same routine I follow every golden week, although I did keep a close eye on Akihigo to dissuade him from trying to anything reckless. Hey. I get the urge to do some boxing practice whenever I'm at school. Maybe I should just get back to it when I feel like I've gotten better. This is exactly why she needs to keep an eye on you, Sonata. What do you think, Yuki? No way. Sorry, my mistake. I was just joking. I was joking. I was joking. Don't give me that face. And anyway, even if you approved of it, there's no way Mitsuru would, too. Didn't your ribs, like, break in half or something like that? Why are you... Just... Ac Sonata's just a very active, hyper guy. Even when his ribs are completely broken, he's still just like, Oh no, I gotta get back to... Gotta get back to training. Just sit still for a moment, dude. Anyways, it's time for some more part-time job. Okay, courage level up? No. Okay, class is ended for today. So, we have quite a few options. A lot of our social links are open to us right now. Um, Maiko's still not there. One thing that is open, us, up, open up to us, though, is Chihiro. We're finally able to talk to her. How's it going? Um, uh, hello. Um, the other day when you um, invited me out, I've been thinking, um, if it's okay with you, would you um like to... Let's walk home together. Yes. Uh, uh, okay. Um. Then I'll go get ready. Is is this um really okay? Are you sure you don't mind or anything? I mean, um, I I'm glad you're willing to, uh, but. Just relax. Uh, oh, right. I I'm not very good at talking to boys. There are a lot of guys in the student council, though, so I should work on that. Oh, the school is almost out. Let's go. We walked all the way to the dorm, neither of us saying a word. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I was just thinking about uh, what to say. I was trying to come up with a topic you might be interested in, Senpai, but I couldn't think of anything. This is Iwatodai Dorm, right? Do you live here? My house is in the other direction. I should have asked. No, it's not your fault. I noticed we were going in the wrong direction. I should have spoken up. Um, I know you took time out of your schedule just for me, so thank you very much for today. Chihiro seems to appreciate my company. I feel like we've gotten a little closer. She's very sweet. She's actually the one that I decided to romance in my original playthrough of Persona 3 Reload, so there's that. Maybe we'll romance her in this playthrough, maybe we won't. There are people out there who do uh, romance all of the girls, and uh, that's just not necessarily for me. It just felt kind of gross to me. So, we're just sticking to one girl in this playthrough. Well, 
Um, please excuse me. Sup, dude? Hey, have you seen how many of those freaks there are in town lately? Man, things have got to be pretty boring around here if that's the kind of thing that sticks out. How about we go to Tartarus? Oh wait, we hit that dead end, so we really can't go any further? Beats me. The layout of the place supposedly changes every day, so who knows? Hmm, maybe I should go check with you guys just in case. Akihiko, are you trying to make me angry? Hmm. Kirijo Senpai is gorgeous, but man, she's real scary too. But it's true the number of cases around here have been going up. It doesn't feel right to just sit tight and do nothing at a time like this. That was pretty good. You probably think I'm making a big deal out of nothing, but this downtime is driving me nuts. Seriously, why do, bo why do bones take so long to heal? Uh, Akihiko, what is he thinking suggesting that? Clearly it's high time I reestablish some ground rules. Kinda moving through days pretty quickly here, so... And that's mostly just because we don't have too much to do at the moment other than social links and heading over to Polonia to try to raise up our different social stats. There will be some stuff later that we can do that I can comment a bit more on. But right now, let's head over and sing some karaoke. Come on. No, come on. Why? I'll have to look up in between episodes if there's a faster way to raise up um, social stats because I feel like we should be getting much closer to uh, raising those up. Anyways, who do we have? So we've got Tomochika, Odagiri, and Miyamoto, as well as the old couple. Uh, one thing that I will advise against is doing uh, non-school related social links while school is in session because during summer and during weekends these social links become completely inaccessible so be sure to focus on the ones that take place in the school uh, and then save stuff like the old couple or the child at the shrine and stuff like that and other stuff that's outside of school until uh, breaks and stuff like that, like summer break and weekends and various other days off. Anyways, who should we level up? Tomochika is at rank 3, so we're going to continue him because once after we get him to rank 4, we will be able to open up a new social link. And we have a magician here, so let's hang out with him. Hey, you're free, right? Let's hang out. Oh, hey, totally random, but have you ever heard of the- Oh! Have you ever heard of the Gourmet King? Apparently there's a foodie around here who's a cut above the rest. They say he's a student at our school. Wouldn't it be cool if he told us the best places to eat? I'd, tot I'd totally take a date oh, yeah. there. I heard he's really into sandwiches now, so you'd probably catch him eating one in town. So he tells us of the Gourmet King. Wanna talk about it? Don't worry. Oh. Actually, I'm gonna say, never mind. I'm sorry, dude. But now, there's a new social link open at Polonia Mall. And it's this guy, the aforementioned Gourmet King. Mm. Nom nom nom. Hmm? What? Don't look at me while I'm eating. You're making me feel self-conscious. You can't savor the flavor of my gourmet sandwich only available for a limited time with you here. Looks like I have enough charm to catch his attention. Mm, what, what do you want? What are you eating? Listen. Oh, you're curious? Do you fancy yourself a gourmet? Is that even possible? An unrefined guy like you? I think not. You'll have to prove it. If you can pass my gourmet quiz, then I'll believe you. Hmm, what should I ask? I don't want to make it too difficult. Give me some time to think. Nom nom. Ooh, what a sandwich. Now, let the quizzes begin. This first question is a freebie. What's the most popular drink at the cafe over here? So you will have to answer his riddles three if you want to start up his social link. So the answer here is pheromone coffee. Correct. Here's question number two. What color skirt does Azuki Arai's mascot, Azuki-chan, wear? I believe the answer is red? Hmm, you're pretty good. Question three, what item is on the secret menu at Hagakure? I believe that's the Hagakure Bowl. Well done. I'm impressed. You seem to have some knowledge about food, but it pales in comparison to mine. Why don't you bring me something I've never eaten before? It'll have to be quite the odd morsel to fit that bill, though. If you succeed, I'll accept you as a fellow gourmet. For this, you need the item called Odd Morsel. Do we have that?
I don't think we do. Found something. Okay, so we're gonna have to look in Tartarus for an odd morsel. So we'll not be able to start this guy's social link right now, which is a bummer, but... Yeah, we'll come back later. So in a meeting and I heard some someone talk about those apathy syndrome guys. They say that there are more and more of them. A guy could be totally healthy and then BAM, he's got apathy syndrome. Personally, I think they're just overworking themselves, but... Alright. So what personas do we have? So we're gonna go for either... Um... Miyamoto or Tomachika. Tomachika's at three. Track team's at two, so we're gonna hang out with Miyamoto. Because I want to raise them somewhat evenly. Uh, practice! That's today! Let's go! How's it going, buddy? Sup? Class finally let out, huh? You leaving for practice now? Wanna head to track? Wanna head to the track together? That's what I like to hear. Can't have you showing me up all the time. Time to put my game face on. Alright! One more time! I'll show you what I'm made of! Huh? Uh, uh, damn it! Seriously? Uh, Miyamoto! Cause! Anemia? Come on, we're counting on you to be captain next year. The big meet's next year, so you've got time. Just don't overdo it. Hey, you. Uh, why don't you leave practice early and take him home? Sorry. What are you looking at? I'm fine. It's just, uh, my anemia is acting up. Best option here is, are you going to be okay? Of course. It's just, you know, a touch of anemia. God damn it. I can't do it. I can't lie to you. Look, the truth is, it's my knee. It hasn't felt right ever since that day you first came to practice. I tried medicine, I tried wrapping it, but the pain won't stop. The best option here is, will it heal? Of course it will. But I can't afford to stop training, so I'll play through the pain. Next year, there's a national competition. Athletes from all over Japan will be there. The regionals don't hold a candle in comparison. And if I want to win, then I have to spend the next year training. A lot of guys on the team are nosy as hell. If they find out about my knee, they won't leave me alone. So please keep it a secret, okay? We gotta look out for each other. Miyamoto seems to be counting on me. I feel like we're becoming closer. If I go easy on it, I can make it home by myself. Don't worry about me. You get on back to training. Welcome back. It's odd, really, how quiet it's been. It's been a month, but I can hardly believe that that will be the last time they appear outside Tartarus. I agree. There's been a sharp rise in the Lost recently. I wouldn't be surprised if something happened. The mysterious boy I saw during the dark hour warned of an ordeal in one week. Tomorrow will mark exactly one week since then. I should prepare myself today. As Mitsuru says, this quiet, this quiet is certainly odd. I have a feeling something big is on its way. Yuki, get as ready as you can. Hmm? Is something the matter? Hmm. I'll need to further improve my detection ability to pick up on less conspicuous abnormalities. I'll do my best, but this will likely take some time. In lieu of being able to fully rely on my abilities, try to prepare for, lo for all contingencies. Well, you shouldn't be working too hard today, and do you want to know why? Because today is May 8th, and that marks Mitsuru Kurijo's birthday! Happy birthday to her, she turns 18 since she's a senior in high school. So, yeah, happy birthday. Hey, don't you think there's been way too many apathy syndrome cases lately? Wouldn't it be real bad if we don't do anything about it? I guess all we can do right now is focus on beating up the shadows in Tartarus. If the arcade is working on, uh, what's it called? Uh, charm? Or courage? If you're doing courage here, I'm gonna go ahead and choose to level that up. But I'm actually going to do that in the next episode, because we're about to come to a long stretch where I won't be able to pause at any point. 
And so I think it's best if we go ahead and make this episode a little bit short. And then next episode will be probably close to like half an hour. Thank you guys so much for watching. And in the next episode, we're going to go ahead and hopefully succeed at facing whatever comes our way when uh, May 9th comes around and maybe that boy's prophecy comes true. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye!